welcome back to the Collector's Corner. Let's see what we've got going on today. All right, what do we got today? Let's well, today we have apparently an SRM, which it stands for Stay Ready for More. It's a 8CR MOV with G10 scales. It MSRPs at around $24.99, so $25, and that's from SRM. Blade length is 3.57 inches. It's got this thing they call an ambi lock. I guess I don't I don't know the deal about it, but um, yeah. So what's going on with this one? Well, looks like it's got blue G10 scales on it. Um, nice deep pocket clip, which I like this color. The blue G10 on that with this black finish blade on it. Yeah, that looks really nice. And then uh, okay, as you see, yeah, it has milled liners. Mm-hmm. In it. Um, I have no clue if this has bearings or washers. Um, looks like it has a nice thumb disc you take off, um, which uh, I've been pocketing this knife for about two weeks now. And uh, this whole Ambi crossbar lock for 25 bucks, it's 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 good. I mean, it's a great intro, but it really doesn't represent how good these these things are. These these this lock mechanism is. And uh, as you see, if you pull back on this one a little bit. As it, it, it'll bring the blade back up just from just from the uh, tension of the spring. Oh, that's cool. So if you pull the barb all the way back, it will drop. But uh, I found out that uh, pocketing this, that um, when I go use this crossbar lock, I guess because it's a little stiff, I, c I guess it could use an oiling, but the spring's a little stiff to where I really have to press the back of it into my hand just to pull back on this lock. Ooh. So. What's been happening is it's been creating a right there in my a palm of my hand. in your hand. Well, yeah, a hot spot right in the hand. And for 25 bucks, it is what it is. Yeah. But, um, and also, um. But also at 25 bucks, there's maybe something out there that's a little bit more fidgetable. And well, the style points on this is just beautiful. Yeah. I mean, I mean the, the, the blue, if you guys like that, with the, which I was digging it, is, uh, really sweet. The blue and black combo. Yeah, that is really nice. And then with this really beautiful nice. trailing point, which, here, I got to. I got oh, what I'm carrying today is actually a San Remo old one, and that has more the traditional Tonto blade on it. And this is a real small knife, but yeah. know, with the choil and everything. No, that's not a real small knife. What I'm carrying today what are you ca is a real <laughs> small knife. <laughs> okay, See, yeah. I, we're just doing work around well, the house today, and this, this is, is my cinder, put my that little right Kershaw here. cinder. Yeah, we both got shorts on today. So. Yeah, <laughs> just light shorts. It's warm here. It's a little warm here. And if you guys are familiar with this, I mean, just show it right there. Just how small my my little SRA <laughs> or still, San Remo knife is. It's still bigger than my cinder, though. I mean, look, at this. look at how tiny it is. <laughs> the tiny little knife. Hello. This has more the traditional Tonto that you guys are familiar with, with a beautiful chisel grind on it. I mean, you got to sit there and scrape with this, and anything is sweet, man. I, I love pocking this thing. It's so light, and, you know, just another little cheapy Actually, knife, but, man, just a great freaking knife, man. It really is. I mean, just to carry around the house, to just, you know, you've got, like, boxes or strings or just something real quick that you need a short little sharp blade for. Yeah, so this is let's see if I can get a shot on there. Yeah, play it. Oh, let's see if I get it. But anyway, yeah, eight CR right there has that beautiful trailing point. It has really beautiful style features on it. It really, it really it, does. It just has that hot spot. Yeah, and then if it wasn't for this clip either, I'd had I I would have a hard time holding on to this knife, just opening it with it with this ambi lock. I, I'm noticing that I've been having to do a more of a side sweep like this with it mm. to open it to get the the momentum just. Just to open it here. It's like, you know, it, the thumb stud is the best thing about this knife, really. The thumb disc. Mm -hmm. I mean, every single time I use that, just, just, Goes. oh yeah, no problem. That thing yeah. is just sweet. So if you guys, if you guys get this knife, that and that might be the, the way that you guys might want to use it. But if you're, you're looking at for a vegetable knife without oiling this and uh, have oiling it more and breaking it more, it just, it's you're gonna you're gonna find these hot spots and everything on it. But uh. Still really cool. If you guys dig it, check it out. Um, I, I liked it, so I said, you know what, let me go ahead and check this knife out for the price. It was, to me, it was worth it. Um, another one to put in the collection. Yep. That I would share it with everybody. A little, what is that again? It's a cinder. A little Kershaw cinder. cinder. Good yeah. gosh. It's got a little 
Cap lifter. <laughs> yep, cap lifter. I've actually <laughs> used it too. Have so you? I mean, yeah. That little sucker sharp. Yeah, it is. It still is. I mean, I've used it for just little things like opening the cat food boxes and treats and a few cat food cans that didn't want to pop all the way. But yeah, I've only, I, well, I've used this for about two weeks now, and I've just bought an open and mail with it, and just mainly paper, you know, mm-hmm. plastic stuff. Uh, plastic wrapping but uh it's still fairly sharp for the hcr i'm sure i could touch it up no problem yeah. um, if you want to hold this real quick i'll just show them a cut test let's see here let's see after two weeks of using it yeah yeah i mean that trailing point's really gonna does really well mm-hmm. on that tonto trailing tonto That'd it is cool. a really nice design yeah the colors i love it <laughs> black and blue yeah. All right, guys. Well, thanks for stopping in and checking it out. We'll yep. see you on the next one. All right. Bye-bye. Later.